Forget about airdrop. So everything, whatever you're gonna send it from your device to any devices, this is gonna change. You know, you have a local send and some different third party application. This is the next level. It's called Blip. So Blip, trust me, it changes the way you send files between different operating systems. The only thing you have to do is to sign up with your email ID. So if you have sign up and you can send a file to anybody anywhere else, and I'm going to give you a demonstration here. This is how it's going to be done. For instance, if I want to go send something to my MacBook, I will select uh, from here. So if, uh, if I want to send uh, photos, files, a camera, audio, anything you want to send it, it will send instantly. It's faster than a local send. It's faster than an airdrop. It is a faster than a quick share. So you can compare that quick share and you can compare this one as well. So if you go here, you can uh, add, you can remove as well. You can search um, person here and send it to other people. So you see, you can send a file to other people with if you have blip install and set up to send the file, search the people by the name or email address. And if that person doesn't is not in a blip point yet, then they can download the blip and they will be able to enjoy this blip connection. So it sends the file instantly. And anyone who wants to see a file regularly, like friends swapping photos or co-workers sending documents or even a creator sending a big files, it has no restriction. App number four on the list is called a PDF viewers because Adobe is a bloatware and you don't need anything that's heavy.